Hi, I'm Sam. And I'm Andrew. And we're Envy Board Gaming, and we are doing an unboxing of Dog Park. Oh. So Andrew's going to open this. Should be good. It set out in the rain a little bit today. Yeah. But let me cut away some of the soggy cardboard. All right. This is my first unboxing, so... Well, yeah. you've been a part of them, but I want you to kind of... This is your most anticipated game of the year, yeah. right? Yeah, so this is the extra stuff we got, right? I believe this was all the um, Kickstarter exclusives, maybe. I see there's bookmarks and stuff that came with the game. Mm -hmm. yeah, little well, meeple dogs. Yeah, upgraded meeples, I think that's what that oh, is. Oh, yeah, the wooden pieces. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can take that for you. Here's we'll open it up more in depth after we get out of the box. Actual game. Ooh, Ooh what's this? Are these stickers? I, that is the sleeve that goes over the box. Oh. So it says, <laughs> it says collector's edition down here. Oh, so it's a sleeve. I'm pretty sure it's a box sleeve. Not that I needed a bunch of dog stickers, so. but you know. <laughs> right. They had where you could get like playing cards and stuff. So yeah, let's... uh. Let's go ahead and open her up and see what is inside. All right, we went ahead and took the saran wrap off the box. So I you want to open up the Kickstarter goodies real quick? Yes. Oh, there are some stickers in there. All right, All right so here's the little doggy. Meeples, yeah, you want to show those off? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you did get your little dog stickers. That's yeah, a big so dog. There's the little meeples. Oh, they're pretty neat. So you got like a little Dalmatian, a little Corgi, little. Sorry if you can hear the cat. She's outside the door <laughs> meowing because she probably wants to be in here. Um, oh, like a little sheep dog thing. Even though it's a game about dogs, she would yeah. still want to be a part of it. Yeah. So, see, you got some yeah. big. You got your dog <laughs> stickers. <laughs> That's cute. Let's yeah, see. There's those. I believe these are postcards, so you can go ahead and show those off if you want. How excited are you for this game? <laughs> it makes me more excited opening them. Yeah. <laughs> I need to send a corgi postcard to someone. <laughs> there's like the other ones. And cute. then you have a, a bookmark. Aww. Yeah. That's cool. I know they had playing cards that you could buy as well, but... Um, I don't think we needed those. No, I have like eight sets of playing cards that don't get played very often anyway. So, And then this, I believe, is a game, a sleeve for the game. So, yeah, that is... They just, it's interesting that they put it um, separate, in a separate box. So, or in like a little thingy. So you gotta like pre-bend it, but yeah, oh, it should yeah. just go right over the box. So we'll that's put it cool. on there later, but yeah, that's what it is. It's just a sleeve for the game, so that's nice. All right. Ours did come a little, it's got a little ding there, but yeah, it's, not too it's okay. Bad. This is by Birdwood Games. Oh. So yeah, here I can take the, <clears throat> the box and I'll All right, rule here. book. Yeah, let's take a look. Ooh, I like the I like the art on the rule book. That looks nice. Nice little bits that we'll have. Um, this game is considered like a from the Kickstarter, um, kind of like a mix between Wingspan and uh, Parks, if I remember right. A lot of people compared it to like a a mix between those two games. Mm -hmm. The rules don't look too heavy, which is nice. I like the visual examples that they have that's always nice you got final scoring and then you got the solo rules and a number of different variants here so and oh i like the index and they have the faq on the back that's always nice too mm -hmm. so they use the entire rule book that's well, here good. and this is the coll collector's edition so it has yeah. everything that it includes so the upgraded reputation markers all the the ball the stick the treats all those tokens 
So we got, right, the Famous Dogs expansion uh -huh. and then the European Dogs expansion. Yep, and then you also have the kennel boards as well. Yeah. So kennel boards and everything as well. Yeah. So that'll be nice. So these look like the leashes and the... These are little collar tokens. Yeah, do they punch out easy? Let's see. Yeah, nice it's and like your easy. favorite part to do. Yeah, we're, I'm not going to punch them all out. And then I think these you actually punch out and put together as well. Yeah. Um, and they'll have little pieces. So we'll be able to do that. Put them all together and see what they'll look like. So, nice. So here's the board. Oh, yeah. Let's take a look at the board. A big board. Open it up. It's trying to be gentle. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> I'm not a professional. No. No. It's a it's a nice I, I I'm kinda happy that it's in a giant board. Um uh, not gigantic, it's just a two fold. Um The art on it looks really cool. Yeah, it looks a little a little ding or something there, like it got bent in. You got that like a little hole there. No. Not too bad. No. Um Oh yeah, I like the artwork. I like the iconography. It's really good looking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. All right. Almost looks like a painting. Yeah. All right, and then so, these are kennel boards. Yep, those are the kennel boards. So that's nice. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, those are nice. So. I think there's one in every player color. Yeah. Oh look, they got I know. Purple, purple bowl. I just saw that. I didn't see the stuff, but even the toys look a little slightly different. Yeah. Well, maybe not. Yeah, kind of sorta. But yeah, that's neat. Yeah. All right. What are these? So those look like the reputation tokens. Although oh. we have the upgraded ones, don't you? So I'm not sure if those are. No, oh, these no, are different. Those are different dogs. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. Let's see what we got here. We got, this looks like the score, the just a little score sheet, score mm -hmm. pad. Okay. Kind of wish there was more color on that. I mean, the game's very colorful and bright, and then the score pad's a little gray. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. I'm not trying to be picky. I was just like being observant. All right. You want to go through the cards first? Yeah. Take a look at some of the cards here. Go. So I'm going to get them up a little closer. Just look at, I'll put some of these other cards to the side. We'll look at the dogs. So let's be real. That's what we want to see. So you got <laughs> your Irish Terrier. You got your Manchester. Oh, these are all the Terriers. Yeah, they're all together. So that I think each color card is uh, a specific breed. So like mm -hmm. all the Terriers are together. And they put a lot of dogs in here. And I'm pretty sure they... I can't remember if they put it, if people put in to have their dogs put in the game. I think so. Yeah. And then here you have the. So these are terrier dogs. These are the utility dogs. So Boston Terriers in there. Okay. I like the look of the cards, the art on the cards. I don't. I like that there's not a ton of words, and even at the bottom it gives you like a nice little. Some little information about that breed of dog, so that's pretty cool. I'm sure yeah. Samantha will love to read about the different dogs. There's a Chow Chow <laughs> there. The and you got the working really dogs. Good. Yeah, so you got the Doberman, Giant Schnauzer. I'm not going to try to read all of them. Wow. Yeah. Bull Mastiff, Tibetan Mastiff, oh. Alaskan Malamute. Superior Husky. We're getting into the ones I really like, but they shed a lot. Those are the working dogs. Yeah, working dogs. Rottweiler had one of those growing up. Oh, I love the that. gun dog. Retriever. The <laughs> pug for the toy. <laughs> the Great Dane and Siberian Husky. And then these Didn't we already have a Siberian Husky in here? I thought I already saw one. Yeah, it was probably different. So it looks like there's two Siberian Huskies. There's this one, and then there's this one. Oh, yeah. The exact same. Game two for each working dog. Huh. Yeah, I don't know why. There's two of that one. I just really love huskies. Maybe. Yeah, Here's, these there's, uh, these are all the toy. Um, here you 
here. You want to show that? Yeah, sure. Because I can't get up. So we have high. some more toy, or these are the toy animals yeah. or dogs. I shouldn't toy say dogs. animal. <laughs> toy dogs and yeah. <laughs> uh, English toy terrier. Yeah, Looks like a min pin. A Looks like a little min pin there. Yeah. Mm, chihuahua. <laughs> you love chihuahua. Pug. Okay, maybe they do have some miniature pincher. There you go. Yeah. Man, they have so. I wonder if they literally have like every, every breed of dog in here. I feel like they do. Japanese chin. <laughs> I feel like they're always in movies yeah. whenever I see those dogs. Yeah. Then these are the. I've never heard of this breed or this show of or class oh, here's of more dogs. Gun dogs. Gun dogs. Yeah, that was in the other one. I don't know if it was like a an are extra those hunting dog. Yeah, probably. Yeah, they look like it. Yeah. Slovakian rough-haired pointer. Okay. English settler. Some spaniel. Wow, I give them props for all these individual like cars. Did you see the? I know you're a big um. Uh oh my gosh, pitbull fan. Have you seen any pitbulls oh, no, in here? Oh no, I'm looking for it. This is it a Saluki where I used to go to SIU. <laughs> They were the Salukis. That was your. That, that was, was the mascot. mascot. Yeah. It might be in there if you want to see if the pit bulls are. These there. are. Here, I'll give those. you those. They're considered a terrier. I know you're looking for the pit bull. Yeah. So let's see here. <clears throat> I'll go through these ones relatively quickly, so you can see all the dogs. So if you might be able to spot your dog. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I well that that's basically what terrier. they're considered is a oh. kind of like a Staffordshire bull terrier. Okay, interesting. Um, unless they have an actual. I don't think I've seen one. Yeah. But then again, I have been going. These are the pastoral dogs. Yeah. Does it mean that the dogs are pastures? I'm just <laughs> kidding. I know they're not. I know that's not what it means. I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they what that know. means though. But yeah, they they have uh, this guy, the Staffordshire. So that's terrier. that's what you think. The, that's the what they descend from, pretty much. I think oh. pit bulls are kind of like a okay. like a, a mutt. We're getting into descendants. Yeah, <laughs> nickname the Staffy. Okay. They're known as wonderful family pets. They're Ooh. especially affectionate with children. Oh, we have even more. Oh, these are the little walkers, too. Yeah, I like that they put fun facts on here. So we have these. I think weren't originally screen printed like this. I think this is all part of the deluxe when they look nice like that. I'm not sure. I know they had met a lot of stretch goals when they did this game. So I like the pastel-like colors. Yeah, me you too. Know? So you got the different colored walkers mm -hmm. um, so yeah you got those there so I'll put those outside how about all these sweet wooden bits yeah. look at that you got your I don't know your little squishy <laughs> the toys toy. <laughs> yeah. the to the different toys you got a tennis ball you got like a stick mm -hmm. and you got some other uh, treats it looks like is what I'm guessing treats mm -hmm. But yeah, those are really nice. I like that. They're those chunky. Are nice bits. Yeah, I think those turned out really, really well. Mm -hmm. Really nice. I like that. Cool. Nice. And, and we'll get these all we'll get these all sorted and show you guys what it looks like all put together. These are the nice the little yeah, bone holes. The game trays. Those look nice. I believe this, yeah, was done by game trays as well. So let's keep everything organized. We'll be able to have you have a set, I'll have a set to play. Yeah. Oh, yeah. this is a dog house. Yeah, that might be like the first player token or something, would be oh. my guess. Or maybe a round marker. Dog, dog house. That would be my guess. Okay. Let's see what else we got. There's here. a bird oh. and a Here's dice. the little pieces to put those dials together. Ooh. Isn't that? Oh, I like that dice. It looks cool. Yeah. Makes me think of. Uh, Eli's game out fox to have little paw prints. Oh yeah. Okay, we got what looks like some player boards in different colors. Mm -hmm. Red, purple, yellow, green. Okay. Let's see here. We got the 
I think these are different like scoring cards, I think. Uh, I could be go I could be completely wrong though. So you got all the different types of dogs. I don't think I would have known there's that many dogs. <laughs> and then there's all of these cards. I'm guessing they're like scoring cards um, for a round for each round. Maybe you go for a certain thing called forecast cards and breed expert cards. So that's what they're. Mm. Okay, and then you got the expansions. Yeah, famous dogs. All right, what what is the most famous dog that you think is in here? I honestly don't remember famous? what they put. In. Yeah, that's what it says. Famous dogs. Are we talking like Lassie? Probably popularity, like maybe owned by. The or most. is it like a famous dog? Like is it like Cujo? Is Cujo <laughs> in this game? I need to know. Here, would, let me help I you out here, it. friend. Let me help you out here. Famous um, dogs. I would say the lab is going to be in there. A golden retriever. You don't think it's like a movie dog or like a, uh, like, like a Paris Hilton's dog? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. So, yeah. So, you have the expansion here. Oh, look at the, little, the back of the car. Isn't, uh, isn't that the creator, their dog? I thought. I don't know. I remember them saying that. Maybe. So, let's see here. Uh, this is a pastoral shepherd dog. I don't know who he is, who he belonged to. Uh, I'm guessing I was wrong. Cujo, oh, there's a collie. Is that yeah, like Lassie? Lassie yeah. See, Lassie <laughs> made it in the game. Okay. There's a oh, Welsh course. corgi. Yeah, they're okay. famous. Yeah. Wasn't, didn't the queen have those or somebody? Yeah, I don't know. she does have those. Well, she, well, she did. did. Yeah. I, who wow. has them now? <laughs> R.I.P. I don't know. Maybe King Charles. Um, okay, we got some Spaniels, some Italian. I I, I was hoping for Cujo. <laughs> Ooh, Basenji. That's fun Ooh, to say. Ooh, he looks fancy. I kind of <laughs> like that dog. Basenji. And he looks short-haired, so I'm all down for that. <laughs> Dachshund. Yeah. Bloodhound, yeah. Ooh, the Afghan ham. They just look prissy. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Oh, look yes, at the bath that ham. He looks so cute. Don't step on them ears. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the Target dog. Yeah. I always think of Target. They are really cute. Uh, whoa, look at the <laughs> forehead on that thing. I don't mean to make fun of dogs, but whoa. That looks like a mean He dog. looks mad already. I didn't draw you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Pomeranian. I yeah. stepped on one of those on accident once when I was a kid. Oh, my God. He was under a blanket. I couldn't see How him. do you even say that? Those are Go like ahead. one of those... Uh, How do you say it? Oxalate scundle. I don't even know. Yeah, something like that. That's like a Egyptian looking dog. Can you say this one? That's a... Uh, ooh. Shipperkey. I know those. Shipperkey? Shipperkey. <laughs> oh. A Japanese Akita. Yeah. Inu. <laughs> I knew. St. Bernard. There we go. Beethoven. I knew Beethoven would make an appearance. Oh. You know who that is? You know what movie he's from? Is Although, that... actually, I think the one. No, that's not him. I was thinking of Turner and Hooch, but he's a, oh, he's a massive yeah, of yeah. sorts, if I remember right. Oh, look at him. <laughs> the big lips. Yeah. Oh. Nice. So okay. Those are the famous dogs. All right. All right. How about the European dogs? I felt like we already care covered all the dogs of the world. <laughs> no. Are there a whole other breed of Look European how many dogs cards there. that I don't know about? <laughs> is there all? Are there? These aren't all. Those weren't all the dogs. After all these, no. we go through all these stacks of dogs, <laughs> and there's still famous dogs, and now there's European dogs. Yep. So let's see. Ooh, Ooh Brittany. Or Brittany. That's Is that just the name? Yeah, yeah. That's the breed? There's a Brittany yeah. dog. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, interesting. Oh, Hungarian wire tail. Uh, I don't know if it's the writing. I can't read it. Visla. Visla. Retriever. A musterlander. Here, I'll hold him up a little higher. Man, the the dash hounds have been making all. There's a few of them in here. Or Ooh, dachshund. Dachshund. Yeah, yeah, what am I saying? Um, clearly, you're the dog. Whoa, there's the mop dog. <laughs> Hungarian. Hungarian pulley. Oh, that's funny. Man. There's so many. 
There are lots of terriers. Glenn. I just want to call him Glenn. I don't care about <laughs> the... Because he looks like Glenn? It just, it just says Glenn of ML oh. Terrier. Glenn. That's Glenn. Okay. Uh, oh, the Welsh, Welsh Terrier. Terrier. Yeah. Oh, Russian toy. He looks Russian. I mean, yeah. if, if Russian dogs had a look, to me, that's a Russian look. Yeah. Not to be insensitive to Russians. I'm sorry if you don't like the dog, <laughs> but I'm just saying. Oh, gosh. Um, yeah, master. Oh, oh there, there he is. goes. Yeah. Although I think I think uh, Hooch is a bull mastiff. I could be wrong. Oh, yeah. I mean, you know how they have all these sub sub things. So you got all the European dogs. You got all the all the famous dogs. You got all the other dogs. You got dogs upon dogs upon dogs. This is my kind of game. Right. So now we're going to go ahead. We're going to organize it and put everything where it's supposed to go and show you what it looks like back in the box so you know where everything should go when you do your unboxing and organizing everything. So this is going to be my favorite part. Mm -hmm. And I'll come back and show you guys what it looks like. And we're back to show you how we organize Dog Park. Yeah, so we went ahead and punched everything out and put it all together and even put the little sleeve on so you can see the cute little dogs. Is this just me or is that dog's head not <laughs> yes. match his body? I was about to say that. That's a, I think that's a real thing, though. Like, because that what? is a different breed of dog. <laughs> but, I don't know, but to me, the dog's head doesn't match his body. <laughs> I was just, but if that's a real dog, no, I, I love that dog. I think that's how it's supposed to be. Because I saw the card. Oh, well, I need to go yeah. find that card now. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, poor dog, probably gets made fun of. <laughs> All right, so I'll pull the sleeve off. Sorry, I pulled it off screen there for a second. He's a little snug, but that's, that's not a bad thing. All right, so then collector's edition. All right, so we have that. I'm not going to go through the rule book and everything again. So you're gonna have your game board right here, right on top, um, after you have your rules. So you take that off. Then you're gonna have your kennel boards. So you'll have these upgraded ones. I believe this was with the collector's edition. Yeah, you have these uh, kennel boards here. Then we put the uh, score sheet up here at the top because there wasn't really a space. So. Um, it seems like this is the best place to put it. If you try to put it on top of everything else, it box lifts up. So this seems to be the best place to put it and you don't have to worry about any lift. All right. So we have those. Um, we have our little fancy dials all set up. I don't know what these are used for, but I'm excited to figure it out. Samantha is going to teach us how to play tonight, right? <laughs> yeah. You have all your trays that are really nicely, they don't flip over, they're snug, things stay where they're supposed to stay, which is always a good thing. Um, that way you don't have to reorganize it, but I do like this. Mm -hmm. Any game that has these removable game trays makes setup so much faster, it makes it, the game so much more organized. If you're designing a game, I think this should be like a must have thing. These nice game trays. Okay. Um, like I said, our, you already have your dials. Um, we have the the dog cards up here. Um, and I went ahead and I just put, if you have the famous dog or European dogs over here. But then as we were talking about, I was like, oh, why are there two Siberian Huskies? Why are there two Pugs? Well, the reason is, is because uh, we have a first edition of Dog Park. So it has alternate art. So I went ahead and pulled those out too, just to keep them separate because you're supposed to swap them out. Um, so you shouldn't have multiples of the same dog. Uh, if you do, it's because you have that alternate art to it. That's cool. Yeah. Um, here we have these player boards there. So those fit in right there. And underneath you're gonna find your breed expert cards, your forecast cards, your location bonuses, your objectives. Um, here are where all your little dog meeples are going to go. If you have like the upgraded extra, the ones from the Kickstarter, you can't fit them all in there. So we put the, the big one here, the German Shepherd. We stuck him over here with the walkers just because he fits in there really nicely and uh, doesn't cause any, any problems. So yeah, so that's how you're going to 
rebox everything up and keep it all organized. So hopefully that helps when you get your copy and you need to see where everything goes. Um, we didn't really find a space for the dice, so we put the dice in here with the trays in case you were wondering. Um, we, we thought maybe it went here That's with the doghouse, like, but... but it created lift and then it pushed everything up. So uh, yeah. there's plenty of space in here though. You can just throw the dice in. And that's uh, that's pretty much it. So yeah, I think we're gonna probably jump right into setup and play this game right now tonight. So yeah, but uh, I want to. Right. So um, yeah, let us let us know if you like these kinds of videos. Um, I I like doing the unboxings and the reboxings because I feel like a lot of times I get a game and if I don't have anything to show me how to put it back together, I can get a little lost. So I like doing that portion of the videos. Um, but yeah, let us know if this is a game that you backed or one that you're excited to get your hands on i think it's coming to retail i'm pretty sure uh and so yeah let us know what you think what your excitement level is for this game and uh please like comment subscribe and click the bell icon uh, to let us know if you like this kind of content and we'll keep doing it and we'll see you guys on the next one thanks for watching see ya